there are three types of sponges, asinoid, sequinoid, and leucinoid. Asinoid sponges are the most primitive and simplistic in structure. They have radial symmetry and are tube shaped. Sycanoid sponges. This is the next level of complexity in sponge architecture. They are typically vase shaped like the asinoid sponges. They also have radial symmetry. These sponges are able to get bigger than asinoid sponges. Leuconoid sponges. This is the highest level of complexity in sponges. They have lost radial symmetry and are very irregular in shape and may attain large sizes. These are the biggest sponges. Sponges are very simplistic animals. Water flows through them and that's how they get their nutrition. They live on rocks and they are attached to them so that the water can flow through them easily. They cannot move by themselves so they reproduce asexually. Sponges role in agriculture and ecosystems is very insignificant. Water flows straight through them and the amount of nutrients they take from it is negligible. Humans will also dive in and take sponges out of the water to use for their personal use.